Every time I'm in the street, I hear Before we get started, here's some information you'll be needing in today's tutorial. Skipping over the part where it takes me a million years to adjust and clean up because quite frankly no one wants to see that. Um, basically on the other side of your eye it's just meant to replicate um, the side that we just did. There's, there's nothing that you really need to see. Okay, now that that's done, we're going to be drawing the eyelashes. Very awesome reminder, always create a new layer when we're drawing a new element. Ha, ah, sucker, I lied, we're actually doing black instead of white. Anyways, adjust your stabilizer settings and we're going to be drawing the eyelashes in a triangular motion pointing upwards. When you're drawing the eyelashes, make sure that you're not drawing it to fill it in straight away, like what I just tried to do there. I've just draw two lines pointing upwards connecting in a curved triangle then we're going to switch off the stabilizer settings and fill it in afterwards I'm so sorry this was supposed to be like an apology tutorial video because I haven't been here for a while and I just sound half dead I'm sorry I'm tired <laughs> please forgive me I swear I am very much excited to start doing videos again but man I'm tired <laughs> forgive me for me, the perfect eyelash formula is two eyelashes pointing towards the inner corner of your eye, then two eyelashes pointing towards the outer corner of your eyes. Is outer corner a word? Outer corner. That doesn't sound like a legit word. That's not even a single word, that's two words. But you, you guys understand, right? Yeah. 
totally i hope i hope you guys understand <laughs> Anyways, once you're done with the eyelashes, just be a perfectionist and very very lazy, just duplicate the layer, flip it and then move it towards the other eye and make sure that it fits. Normally I like to do the highlight at the end, like when I'm finished doing the whole eye. It just feels so satisfying. Um, I just couldn't resist doing it now, so forgive me. <laughs> um, so you can do it now if you want when I'm doing it, or you can do it at the end. I'm not sure, it's really up to you. Okay, so we're going to re-switch our stabilizer settings on. Make that pen nice and big and where we connected, like the corner of the eye. Now at the bottom of your eye, we're just going to connect it all. I don't know. We're just going to make it seem all together. Je ne sais pas. That's French for I don't know. Did you guys know that I'm bilingual? Kind of. I'm not fluent in French, but I come from a French family. We're not French, but we're Congolese. And in Congo, um, our second language is French. And I'm also Caribbean and... Um, yeah, so um, in one of our, in, one of our um, in the countries, yeah, we, we speak French, so I know a bit of French. Cool, right? Just like outlining the bottom of your eye, just connecting it, it just it it changes the entire vibe. It just looks so. Oh my god, oh my god, simp. I'm simping over eyes. Oh my god, give me strength. But you know, like I said, it changes the whole ambience of the eyes. It looks amazing, doesn't it, you guys? Okay, now this part is optional, um, so we're going to create a new layer and we're going to set the blending mode to multiply. Um, we want to put the opacity down to 25% to 50%, it honestly depends on your skin tone. Um, so yeah, just put the opacity down, then colour pick your skin tone or the outline of your skin. And we're going to be drawing the eyelids. So what we're going to do in a curved motion, um, like a bridge from um, not completely over your whole eye so just where um, in the middle of your outer corner eyelash to um, just not too far into the inner corner of your eye you're going to want to draw your eyelid basically um I don't know I consider um, like the elongated eyelashes like eyeliner so it's not like your eyelids are going to connect to your eyeliner and to the inner corner of your eye <laughs> eyeliner it's your, it's your eyelids, basically. Yeah. <laughs> going to be doing the exact same thing on the bottom of your eye, just in the corner, in the outer corner.
like this cute little image of me. If you have any suggestions or anything you want to see in my videos, don't forget to comment and I'll do my best to get to you. That's all for today. I love you guys. Bye.